Welcome to Basket of Tales, a time travel into the world of stories. Hello everyone, Ms. S is back with another interesting story from the tales of Panchatantra. Today's story is about a hunter and the dove. Once upon a time, there used to be a huge banyan tree outside a village. This tree provided shade and shelter to a lot of travelers. And it was also a home for many birds like sparrows, crows and doves. One day, a bird hunter was passing by and this huge tree caught his attention. He stopped by and observed for a while. He then got an idea of trapping the birds. He scattered some grains under the tree and laid a thin net underneath. A crow was watching the hunter set the trap and she warned the other birds. But suddenly a flock of doves spotted the grains and they started to feed on grains, unaware of the net. And unfortunately, the hunter trapped them all together in one go. The doves were all worried as they thought that nothing can save them. It was then the king of Dao, who was incredibly wise, thought of a plan. He told all the doves to fly up, taking along the net with them, in order to find a way out to escape from the net. Grabbing a part of the net into their beaks, they flew upwards with full force and strength. They were able to escape from the hunter. The hunter stood watching the doves fly away in amazement. He started chasing the doves, but the doves flew so fast that the hunter finally gave up on them. After flying for a while, they realized that although they were able to escape from the hunter, the net in which they got trapped was troubling them and they couldn't get out of the net. The king dove had another idea. He told the doves, let's fly a little more. My friend Mouse lives there and only he can help us. The doves did not understand and asked the king, how can a tiny mouse release us from the trap? The king dove said, just follow what I say. The doves somehow managed to reach the mouse hole. The king requested the mouse to release them from the net. The mouse started nibbling and biting the net with his sharp white teeth. And within minutes, all the doves were free from the trap. The little mouse appreciated the king for his nobleness. And all the doves thanked the mouse for helping and saving their lives. So the moral of the story is, unity is strength. When there is teamwork, wonderful things can be achieved. Even the weak become strong when they are united. And where there is unity, there is always victory. We have also learned that one must never underestimate someone's abilities, no matter how small he or she is. Hope you like the story today. And remember our four Bs. Be grateful, be respectful, be responsible and be a good listener. Thank you for being a good listener today. Hope to see you all soon.